All right, day three. Day three. <laughs> Grandma's got her yellow work shirt on. Boots, Boots. activated. Nice Beautiful. sunny day today. Beautiful Look at that. No rain today. I'll probably get some drone footage in a little bit. So I'm about to go handle this. Fly back to California tomorrow. And then uh, this will continue when we come back. I'll probably be back sooner than she is, but work on this together when you get here. All right, here we go. Protect your neck. Uh huh. I got my hat backwards. I'm so burnt. <laughs> All right, let's go. Do it. All right, so footing it back to the back of the property. This is our neighbor's lot that they cleared from the road back there. Yeah, we haven't met them yet. <laughs> There's nobody here right now, but it's just easier for us to get to the back of our property from their property instead of going through all this right now. Eventually, we're going to have our trail all the way through. But for now, this is what we're doing. Uh-huh. Bridge is freaking out because look at all the sun that we let in here just by trimming. Watch out for my beer. Uh, behind you. The rainforest floor is getting sun. The ground's drying out. A lot of these plants that are down here, which otherwise wouldn't get any sun, are getting a lot of sun. Okay, back in that corner over there, once we trim that up, that'll get a lot of sun too. So we're here day three, pushing towards the back of the property that way. We're at the end of the trail where we left off. We're gonna head through the bushes here. And you see that nice fern right there? That's gonna be one of those big ferns. It's really, it's huge. It's, it's big already because it goes down here. So we're gonna clear away here. There's a big ohia right there that looks like it's doing good at the top. I would say let's kind of Try to go that direction. Okay. Yeah, it does. Yeah, there are new pig trails, but this is kind of where we ended. The side over there where we stopped, that's sort of where the neighbor's property is going to start Perfect. when I look on the map. So we've got one from one side to one side. So from, to yeah. To mm hmm. So, so from here, we can either, we can meet each other right here if I you want. Yep. Oop. I'm gonna pull some of these branches out. This that whole bush has gotta go. This thing right here, right? Yeah, that's it's shit. <laughs> it's shit. Mulch. This is all busted down. Oh, this piece of here just broke off. Careful. You're good. You're good. Get it, Grandma. Get it. Get it. Get in there. <laughs> All right. The only problem with it not raining in the rainforest is it gets hot. Oh look at this little over here. Got some leaves at the top. There's still life for it. Well we just cleared it. Yeah, now you can get some sun down here. Look at that. Look at that. Look at this. Somebody come look at this. This guy's dead. Watch yourself. I got it. We're good. Mm -hmm. Look at this guy. He's going to take off right now. As soon as we clear this little area, 
I'm gonna get back here. Just trying to get some of these vines out of my damn way. Get ready to pull this guy out. Let's see. Let's get this shit out of here first. Nice. Almost through. Get the sohia free from all these vines. Pull them all off the tree. There's a bunch of Tarzan vines here. Thank you, Lisa, for the rake. Very much coming in handy, as you can see. <gasps> Trim it back there where it's connected. Yeah. I'll pull it all together. Yeah, you're doing good over there. I'm gonna cl start clearing these out here so I can start chopping through here. Yeah, this trail keeps going right here. After, on the other side of these bushes here, it looks like there's a clearing. Like, a lot of things are going on here. Uh -huh. So I'm just chopping. Okay, a lot of those vines are just, they just need to be cut. Yeah. <laughs> It'd help if I was using the right end of the machete. Cut. I'm like, why won't it cut? <laughs> get rid of this tree, push it this way. Right on the other side of this bush here. Uh -huh. That's where we're going. All right, we're doing pretty good, huh? Looking really good. That's where we started, right there, where there was all bush like this right here. We chopped and pushed everything to the side. So we got plenty of open space here for sun to get down to these trees. Plants on the floor. All right, now I just gotta go through there, right on the other side of these bushes here. There's a clearing, I wanna get to these Ohia trees and we'll see where we're at on the map. Take a break, eat some lunch. Yes. Yeah. Mm. Some kind of mushroom here. I don't know what it is. Where's my machete? <laughs> I 
through my machete at the same time. All right, nice. There's a nice little easy walking trail right here. Like some of this grass is starting. Oh yeah. Through here. I have to put some water on my neck. So many itchies. Yeah. 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 It's pig shit. Probably about two acres in now. This area is pretty much open already. Another Whoa. another circular area. What the hell? Find out where we're at on the map. Yeah. Do work, huh? Do work. Little lunch. Hawaiian protein bar. Mm. <laughs> it's so good. Rice, spam, wrapped in seaweed. Yummy. All right, day three. Uh, we just met our neighbor, Angelo Sr. His son's property is next door. Angelo Jr. Very nice man. So here's where we were at yesterday. We're well, not yesterday, on day two. So we made quite a bit of progress. So here is where we stopped last time. Because all right here was just bush. Now look, we've opened it up so much. The rake is right here. Okay. Bridget came from this way, opened this up. There's a tree here, we knocked that down. He's over here now. Got this guy out into the open. And this beautiful fern here. Let that breathe, got that ohia opened up. This guy here too. Another access way. All right. A lot of mud right here in this area. Got these covering a lot of mud. The mud's pretty deep right here. Nice log that's been down here for a while. Looks like the pigs uprooted it. made it this far back and again another rounded area around some trees looks like the pigs just like going around trees and uh you know uprooting everything around the trees but even though we've come that far from over there we're still only one and a half acres in. <laughs> Not even close to the two yet. But there's plenty to go. So next time when we come, I'm gonna bring a chainsaw, cut a lot of trees down that are dead. There's a couple dead ohias right there. Big dead ohias over there. We'll keep the stumps, and make, use the stumps to make a raised tree house. And then even maybe from up there, if we make a tree house high enough with some ohias, we could see the ocean because the ocean is right back there. Nice. So we're pretty much done for the day. We fly back tomorrow. So this will have to continue when we come back. Then we'll come over here and then start making. Uh huh. Clear a garden spot. Uh -huh. Trees in the floor. Mm hmm. So I'm about. 10 feet off the ground in a tree. That's the back of the property. If we get a high enough tree house, we'll be able to see the ocean. I would think a house up on stilts about this high would be do the job. Ocean's right over there. Right at the bottom of the tree line. See some over there. It's probably hard to see on the GoPro, but it's there. All right. Hey. <laughs> 